Selected response section. Answer the following 13 selected response questions. Number one, which situation would lead to a quotient that would be best represented as negative 188? A, a debt of $752 is evenly split among four family members. B, there are 752 cookies evenly split among four birthday parties. C, there are four acres of land evenly split to grow 752 blueberry bushes. Or D, a mountain's four millimeter erosion in height is evenly split over a 752 day period. Number two, a person dives into the ocean and finds object A at a depth of 7.4 meters. He records the elevation of object A as negative 7.4. He finds object B 5.8 meters deeper than object A. He finds object C at three-fourths the depth of object B. How will the diver record the elevation of object C? A, negative 9.9. .9. B, negative 1.2. C, 1.2. D, 9.9. .9. Number three. A rectangular rug has a width of x feet. The length is three and four fifths times greater than the width. Which expression represents the perimeter of the rug in feet? A, three and four fifths x. B, four and four fifths x. C, nine and three fifths x. Or D, two x plus seven and three eighths. Number four, which expression is equivalent to the expression below? Three-fifths minus one-fourth plus two-sevenths. A, three-fifths plus one-fourth plus two-sevenths. B, three-fifths plus negative parentheses, one-fourth plus two-sevenths, close parentheses. C, negative three-fifths plus parentheses, one-fourth plus two-sevenths, close parentheses, or D, negative three-fifths plus negative parentheses, one-fourth plus two-sevenths, parentheses. Number five, which expression is equivalent to the one below? Negative six times negative five-eighths. A, negative six times five over eight. B, negative five over negative six times one over eight. C, negative five times negative six over negative eight. Or D, negative five times negative six times one eighth. Number six, solve negative 1.3 minus two and five sixths. A, negative four and one sixth. B, negative four and two fifteenths. C, negative three and four fifteenths, or D, one and eight fifteenths. Number seven, which expression is equivalent to the one below? Five X minus seven Y minus two X plus Y. A, three X minus eight Y. B, three X minus six Y. C, three X plus eight Y or D, 7x minus 8y. Number eight, which decimal best represents 15 over 33? A, 0 0.4545. B, 0.45 repeating. C, 0 0.455. Or D, 0 0.455 repeating. Number nine, which expression is equivalent to the expression below? Negative one and two fifths plus four ninths. A, one and two fifths minus four ninths. B, negative one and two fifths minus four ninths. C, negative parentheses one and two fifths minus four ninths, close parentheses. Or D, negative parentheses one and two fifths plus four ninths, 
parentheses. Directions, answer the following questions. Number 10, at a magazine company, employees are given a score based on subscription renewals. An employee receives three points for each customer that renews a subscription and receives minus two points for each customer not renewing a subscription. In the course of an hour, an employee has four customers that renew subscriptions and seven customers that do not renew subscriptions. What score would the employee be given at the end of the hour? A, negative 26, B, negative two, C, two, or D, 13. Number 11, use the number line to answer the question below. Which expression has a negative value? A, A minus one, B, negative A plus two, C, negative parentheses A minus two, close parentheses, or D, negative two plus A. Number 12. The lowest elevation in California is about 80 meters below sea level. The lowest elevation in Louisiana is also below sea level and is about one fourth the value of California's lowest elevation. Which value best represents the lowest elevation in meters in Louisiana? A, negative 320, B, negative 20, C, 20, or D, 320? Number 13, compute. Five thirds divided by parentheses, negative one half times negative four, close parentheses. A, negative six over five. B, negative five over six. C, five of six. Or D, 40 over three. Multiple select section. Answer the following two multiple select questions. Each question may have more than one correct answer. You must select all correct answers for credit. Number 14. On the number line below, the value of point B is three units greater than the value of point A. Which expressions are equal to the value of A? Select all that apply. A, B plus three, B, B minus three, C, B plus negative three, D, B plus the absolute value of negative three, or E, B minus the absolute value of negative three. Which situations describe a sum of zero? Select all that apply. A, Juan loans $5.80 to a friend. His friend pays back the full amount. B, a dolphin starts at 7.25 feet below sea level. The dolphin dives seven and a quarter feet down. C, Sam owes his friend $8.75. He spends the same amount on dinner. D, Monday mornings, temperature drops 14.6 degrees Fahrenheit. Later in the day, the temperature rises 14 and 3 fifths degrees Fahrenheit. And E. Cheyenne has 4.5 points after the first round of a board game. In the second round, she earns four and a half points. Extended response section. Answer the following two extended response questions in the space provided in your booklet. For full credit, you must show all your work and provide a clear explanation where asked. Number 16. In January, David had $20.80 in credit card debt. He recorded the amount as negative $20.80 in his account book. In February, he had four-fifths the amount of credit card debt that he had in January. How did he record his amount of debt in February in his account book? Explain your reasoning. Number 17. The number line below shows the locations of numbers negative 1, 0, and 1, and the points Q, R, and S. Use the number line to answer the following questions. A. 
What is the sign of Q plus S? Explain how you know. B, Jason claims that the value of S minus R must be greater than the value of S minus Q. His reasoning is that R is closer to zero than Q. Explain why Jason's claim and reasoning are incorrect using the number line to support your reasoning. 